Hello everyone, Pigeon here again, and today we have got some more celebrations. We have got the Chonky Boy himself. We've got the Pikachu V Max collection box with that amazing Pikachu statue. I don't think this will quite fit on my setup, but let's take a closer look. Let's go. So I was right, it doesn't fit on my setup, but you can see you get a very nice big chunky Pikachu VMAX statue. You get Pikachu V and a Pikachu VMAX promo, which we had in Japanese, but we've not had in English yet. So that's very nice. We also get a good, what, three packs and then of normal product and then six packs of celebrations. So let's take a closer look. Let's unbox this thing and let's see what we can find. So we have three normal packs, one chilling rain, one video voltage, and one darkness of blaze. They're your normal packs, so not a bad selection of packs there. We also have, I believe it's eight, eight celebrations packs. So you get a good select a good amount of celebrations packs there. So hopefully we can get something good. So hopefully we can get some secret rares that we didn't get in our ETB and our collector's chests. We have the Pikachu V promo. Not the best Pikachu art, but it's quite cute still. And then we have the Pikachu V Max, who looks like he's cheering, celebrating himself. Look at that beautiful card. Uh, in Japanese, it was for the Astonishing Volt Tackle promos, which actually became a quite an expensive card just because it was a promo card. And then the big chunky boy himself. Look how happy he is. Look at that face. You can't not love that face. That is an amazing statue. I really love this. Oh, it's so good. I'm so happy they bought uh, Dynamax Pikachu back or just Chunky Chew back in Sword and Shield. But let's get into the packs. So like all other Celebrations products, we will start with the normal packs first. We'll start open with some Chilling Rain. Our one pack of Chilling Rain. Now, one pack, I don't really think you can ever get anything too good from one pack. But there is your code for Chilling Rain. I'm not going to give the code away for the VMAX collection box because I actually want it for TCG Online. Four from the back, and we have a water energy to start us off. Fire resistant gloves, welcoming lantern, raboot, blitzel, ghastly, coughing, deli bird, glaring far fetched, a sunny form cast form reverse into a Celebi V. So, not too bad. We get half art in our first pack. That is a very good pull. Right, second pack, we are on to Vivi Voltage. Obviously, has several chunky chews in itself it's got the pikachu v's it's got the pikachu v max it's got the rainbow pikachu v max can we get a chunky chew inside our chunky chew box let's see i hope we can that'd be amazing if we could all round chunkiness another water energy Caralis, stone energy electric rock rough taylo yanma whooper dedane reverse hollow beldum into a Magurney Hollow, so that is not too bad actually. So we've got two hits from two packs, which is very nice. And our last pack of normal packs, Darkness Ablaze, Center Scorch artwork on the front. There is your code for Darkness Ablaze. Can we get three out of three hits in all of our normal packs? That would be something good. We start off with Fire Energy, Familiar Bell, Struggle Gloves, Clang. Glary, Mr. Rhyme, Mr. Mime, sorry, Torchic, Aaron, Rookie D, Wishy Washy, Glary and Mr. Mime Reverse, and a non holo Vocorona. So we can't get a hit in all of our normal packs. Now it's time for the eight celebrations packs. We've still got a few secret rares we are looking for. Can we find one of the still two chase cards we're looking for. We still need the Charizard and the Umbreon Gold Star. They're the two chase cards I need from the set or want from the set. And they are still two of the secret rares that I haven't found. So can we get them here? So there's no card trick, card trick obviously. So we have Lugia, Grudon, Cosmog, and a Mew as our first pack. So nothing too incredible there. Second pack of celebrations. The pull rates for celebration have been insane, and I think that's why it's gotten a lot of love. I know it's only a small set, but everyone seems to be pulling good stuff, and it's just something you love to see. You want it from a holiday set. So let's see if we can find some more magic. So Zekrom, 
Cosmo him. Oh, we do get some more magic. We don't get the Charizard we're looking for, but we get another Blastoise. We got Blastoise in our ETV, and I already had one in my first ETV that I opened off camera. So this is my third Blastoise, and that is a great pull. More great texture neon. I love the texture on these classic cards. Oh, beautiful, beautiful card. And to end, it is a Lunala in the background. So three packs in, and we've got our first classic card. Two Blastoises now I've got spare. So if you need a Blastoise, hit me up on Twitter. We can discuss trades. If you want to trade a Blastoise for a Charizard, let me know. I am all down for that. So this time we have Cosmog, Yelvatul, Lugia, and a surfing Pikachu VMAX. Another chunky boy in all his goodness. You can go right there with, you, with your fellow chunky brethren. Chunky, chunky, chunky choo. Not too bad. One classic card from three packs. It's not too bad. One every two packs is a pretty good pull rate. I'll be happy if we can get four classic collections. I'll be happy if we can get classic collections that I don't have, actually. So that is Xerneas. Uh, what else have we got? Xerneas, Umbreon, Charizard, uh, Tapu Lele, and there's a couple others. I can't remember. Garchomp, I think, is one. So Cosmog. Yelvatul, and there we go. We got one of the secret rares I do not have, which is Tapu Lele GX. Ah, oh, probably the one I'm not excited about because it's a recent reprint, but the texture on it is very good, and the shimmer on that pattern is lovely. So, Tapu Lele GX, followed by another normal Mew. If we can get a gold Mew, I'll be happy. I pulled it in my ETB that I opened off camera, but if I can get a uh, gold Mew on camera, I'll be very happy. Right, so we are halfway through the celebrations packs. Two secret rares from two from four packs this isn't too bad. If we can keep that rate up, that's very good. Let's see if we can find some more goodness. Oh, so the last cards are Lunana. I've shown that off already, but it's the classic collection cards we're hunting. So Cosmog, Yelvatul, we got a Blastoise. Now we have a Venusaur as well. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous Kanto Pokemon and then Lunana at the end. So, Blastoise, Venusaur, and a Tapu Lele GX. Oh, come on, there has to be a Charizard in these last three packs now. To complete the trio, you just have to have a Charizard, surely. Come on. Willing it into existence. Be a Charizard. There has to be a Charizard. Come on. Come on. Right, so we have a Lugia. Cosmoem. Ah, uh, no Lugia this time. We have a Groudon. And then a Flying Pikachu V. Another Chonky Choo. All of the good boys. All of the happy boys. Ah, oh, Celebrations is just such a fun set to open. Hits, hits, hits. There's always, always pulls. If, I just wish it was a bigger set is all. Right, second to last pack now. Come on. Second to last pack. We have Cosmog. Cosmoem. Come on, Charizard. No. Oh, we get a second. We, why can't you just give me the Charizard? We get a Blastoise again. So we take a look at that. And then a Lunala. So... There we have two Blastoises. Oh, I love these cards. They're absolutely beautiful cards. And now our last Chonky, uh, chonky Choo Pack. Celebrations Pack. Oh, chonky Choo Pack. What am I on? Can we get another Classic Collection Pack uh, hit in our last pack? Let's see. So, Yelvatul, Kyogre, Dialga, and Lunala. So, nothing from our last pack, unfortunately. But, we've got a lot to talk about. Let's go through them. So, we've got a lot to talk about this, actually. So, we've got the Magurnia Hollow from Vivi Voltage. We have our Celebi V from Chilling Rain. Flying Pikachu V. 
just a normal Pikachu V promo from the box. The Pikachu V Max from the box, which is a lovely card. Look at him happy and waving his arms in the air. We have surfing Pikachu V Max also waving his arms. Tapu Lily GX. Venusaur, our first Blastoise. And then our second Blastoise. So we got three Kanto starters. It's a shame it wasn't a Zard, because having a Zard, a Blastoise, and a Venusaur all in one opening would just be absolutely insane. Celebrations continues to give out hits. That's four classic collection cards, albeit two Blastoises and a Venusaur. Cards we've already got, but Tapu Lili GX is near, uh, one we didn't have, so we are one closer to that master set where we pulled all the cards ourselves. My next video will be my Ultra Premium Collection. I was lucky enough to get one of them up in Pigeon. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.